Eagles and the Help Me Girl. That'll do it for the Larry McCormick Show today. I'll see you at three tomorrow. Jimmy O'Neill standing by to give you the full measure of the loving spoonful on KFWB Group W. Westinghouse Broadcasting for Los Angeles. It's three o'clock. This is KFWB News. Good afternoon. I'm Bill Angel. A freighter which has been dismantled burst into flames today and officials cleared a huge Navy shipyard fearing an explosion from residue in the hull of the vessel's fuel tanks. More than 48,000 gallons of the fuel were reported to be aboard, but this later proved to be incorrect. The fire apparently began when a spark from a welder's torch ignited the residue left in the tank. An aircraft carrier in the Atlantic Coast dock being dismantled at the same pier was in danger of being set afire. Firemen cleared workers from the yard, but there was no report of injuries. A spokesman for the Coast Guard said the unidentified freighter was burning mainly in the fuel compartment and an explosion was feared in a gasoline compartment located next to it. All ships in the vicinity of the burning vessel was ordered to steer clear. Water was poured onto the old freighter in an attempt to drown the fire. There are no sig alerts in effect. KFWB News Time is 3.01. Two electricians were injured today in a flash explosion on the fourth floor of a towering new City National Bank building downtown. They were working in an electrical vault when the main switch cable was short-circuited, causing an electrical flash which hurled the two men across the room. Other workers pulled the men away from the smoke-filled room. The victims, Robert Ibera of Pico Rivera, was critically burned over the upper portion of his body. Jobin Jackson of San Gabriel was seriously burned. That floor of the new building was not occupied at the time of the explosion. It is now Saturday morning in Vietnam, and the second holiday ceasefire has now gone into effect. Its duration is 48 hours. U.S. troops have been ordered to be vigilant against any red violations, and extra police patrols are posted in the city of Saigon. American ground and air forces pulled back into defensive positions after delivering their final blows of the year against the enemy in North and South Vietnam. In the meantime, the administration has been urged by a group of 84 businessmen and the head of the Roman Catholic Peace Group to curb any escalation of the Vietnamese war. This in a letter to President Johnson. This while communist diplomats in London said Hanoi has little desire at this time to talk peace because worldwide opinion on U.S. policy seems to be in their favor. The Southland sniper, a suspect in Christmas Day murder. KFWB newsman Beach Rogers has that story. A man suspected of being the motorist sniper who terrorized southwest suburban areas of Los Angeles is in custody and has been linked to the mystery slaying of a 19-year-old girl on Christmas Day. The girl, Barbara Jean Jones, was shot in the back and fatally wounded as she was leaving a house party early Christmas Day. Sheriff's detectives say the fatal bullet came from a 22 caliber automatic belonging to the sniper suspect, 26-year-old Peter Nick Toma Jr., an unemployed machinist apprentice. Ballistics tests show that the same weapon that was used to kill Miss Jones also wounded three motorists early Wednesday. Toma was arrested after deputies observed an auto matching the description of the sniper's car near his home. He was booked on a charge of attempted murder, which was later changed to murder when he was linked to the slaying of Miss Jones. The sniper was described by some of his victims as a cool sharpshooter who fired repeatedly at them in the cases when he drew his car alongside other vehicles on the harbor in San Diego Freeway. He also shot a pedestrian from Tulare early Wednesday. This is Beach Rogers, KFWB News. The Texas White House declared today that anti-poverty programs have lifted some 8 million Americans out of the needy bracket since Rogers, K- back in 1960, and President Johnson hopes to ease the burden of another half million by next July. The chairman of the House subcommittee, looking into the activities of Harlem Congressman Adam Clayton Powell, recommended that Powell's estranged wife be fired from her present high-pay federal job as Powell's special secretary. The job she currently holds pays more than $20,000 a year. The subcommittee has been investigating Powell's situation as a congressman for the past several weeks. Two prisoners were wounded in traffic court this morning here in Los Angeles after one of them grabbed a deputy sheriff's revolver from its holster in an apparent effort to escape. Hit were Benjamin Castillo and William Wilson, both of Los Angeles, but they were not wounded seriously. Officers said Wilson and Castillo, held on traffic warrants, were lined up against a courtroom wall. Wilson allegedly grabbed the gun as the officer passed by. Three shots were fired, one hitting Castillo in the right leg. The other hit the ceiling as everyone in the courtroom hit the floor. Wilson was wounded during the struggle when deputies tried to disarm him. Both wounded men were taken to Central Receiving Hospital. 
The closing Dow Jones stock average is 30 industrials, down 0.83, 20 rails, down 0.27, 15 utilities were down 0.61, 65 stock index was down 0.48. Sales today were 11.33 million shares. No smog prevails, sunny tomorrow with the high clouds and gusty winds. Warmer days, 61 degrees at Civic Center. This is Bill Angel, KFWB News. And this is Jimmy O'Neill, KFWB Music, saying howdy, hi, everybody. Welcome into round one of Fun and Adventures, musically speaking. Throughout the afternoon hours till six tonight, you're on the go with J.O. The Love and Spoonful sing Full Measure. The full measure of your giving You don't yet understand Spoofle have not made two records that were alike in a row yet, and that one is certainly no exception. Hey! You're on the go with J.O. again to the two question mark in the mysterious. I need somebody from JFWB, baby. I need somebody to help me out. I need somebody.
Smash your mark in the mysterious on KFWB Jimmy O'Neill Show this afternoon at 10 minutes past 3 o'clock. Speaking of, I need somebody, friends, you know, your neighbor may need help. The sick child, the aged, the infirm, the emotionally disturbed, the youth in need of guidance, advancing the cause of human rights. The Jewish Federation Council of Greater Los Angeles extends its hand to all of them and to millions of others around the world. With 61 degrees in KFWB country at 10 past 3 in the Jimmy O'Neill Show... It's Mama Cass and the Mamas and Papas singing Words of Love. and everything she's got into that one called Words of Love on KFWB's Jimmy O'Neill Show 12 minutes past the hour of 3 o'clock and time to keep the music coming your way from you know where <laughs> KFWB Channel 98 Larry McClellan Cushy knows on the air every day from noon to 3 just got off a few minutes ago just handed me a note saying uh, Jimmy there are 127 people at the Englewood branch of Pacific Tele and Tell who are listening right now and I want you to say Happy New Year to Barry Western and all the guys and gals out there and play the Buffalo Springfield record, which is their favorite. You may be interested in knowing uh, all you guys and gals out at uh, Pacific Tell and Tell that I've scheduled that record approximately a half hour from right now. In the meantime, a number one record in Los Angeles for a number one bunch of people. Thanks for listening this afternoon. Love is only true in fairy tales. The monkeys. And for someone else, but not for me. Was out to get me. That's the way it seemed. Disappointment haunted all my dreams. Then I saw her face. Now I'm a believer. Not a trace. A doubt in my mind. I'm in love. I saw her face Now I'm a believer Not a trace A doubt in my mind I'm in love I'm a believer I couldn't leave her if I tried
saw her face Now I'm a believer Not a trace Put out in my mind I'm in love I'm a believer I couldn't leave her if I tried I'm a believer. 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 I'm a Providence and St. Joseph's tangled for the holiday festival title in New York, and Bradley meets Utah for the Sugar Bowl championship. Millionaire Buck Passer makes his Western debut tomorrow in the Malibu Stakes at Santa Anita. Now, Cleve Herman. Sandy Koufax has destroyed the premise for a lot of well-thought-out father and son talks about the disadvantages of a career as a professional athlete. Can't you see old dad telling his boy, sure, you'll be famous for a while, but once you're through, you'll be behind all your friends getting a start in business. And you might be done as young as 31, and then all you'll be able to do is sign a contract for 10 years at 100000 a year. This is Cleve Herman, the Lifeline to Sports. Hey, W-E-H. I cry. Oh, Johnny Ray hit entitled Cry from KFWB's Jimmy O'Neill Show. But fear not, because good things are just around the corner in the form of music by Paul Revere. Whether you prefer your beer in cans and bottles or on tap, what really counts is the goodness of the beer itself. And that's why more people who live in California 
are changing to Miller High Life. They are recognizing the superb quality of a beer that takes more time to brew and always tastes worth the extra steps and patience. Insist on Miller High Life. After all, it is the champagne of bottled beer. Always sparkling, flavorful, distinctive. Miller Brewing Company, Milwaukee. Channel if you're watching the weather, friends, it's currently 64 degrees in Hollywood. It looks like mostly clear tonight and sunny Saturday and Sunday. Strong gusty north or northeast winds tonight and Saturday. Low tonight, mostly 30 to 40 degrees. High tomorrow, 68. Music list with another big smashing hit called Good Thing. I'll tell you one good thing I know, and that is how easy it is for you to help someone out. Someone who needs help right away. Just join up with a fight against birth defects. Give all you can for care and research for the life of a child. Send in a generous contribution to March of Dimes, Los Angeles 954. 23 past 3 from KFWB's Jimmy O'Neill Show. 62 degrees on a beautiful Friday afternoon. Nancy Sinatra's here to sing Sugar Town. I got some troubles, but they won't last. I'm gonna lay right down here in the grass. And pretty soon all my troubles will pass. Cause I'm in shoo shoo shoo. Shoo shoo shoo. Shoo 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 sugar town.
past three. I don't know if you've noticed, but the beat goes on again. Have you be around the clock? Play more music than I've ever heard on a radio station my whole life. The beat goes on. That's the truth. The beat goes on. Sonny and Cher singers. Drums keep pounding a rhythm to the brain. la da 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 dee la da 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 Sonny and Cher on the Jimmy O'Neill Show, and this is KFWB Group W, Westinghouse Broadcasting for Los Angeles. Standing in the shadows of love, I'm getting ready for the heartaches to come. Can't you see me standing in the shadows of love? I'm getting ready for the heartaches to come. But there's nowhere to go, cause heartaches will fall. Right now, baby, didn't I? Didn't 
Tops moving out of the shadows of love into the starlight of the KFWB sound around the clock with more music per minute. 61 degrees in Los Angeles on the Jimmy O'Neill Show. 3.32 on a Friday afternoon with Frank Sinatra in to philosophize a little bit for us to the tune of That's Life. That's life. That's life. That's what all the people say. You're riding high in April, shot down in May. But I know I'm gonna change that tune When I'm back on top, back on top in June I said that's life And as funny as it may seem Some people get their kicks Stopping on a dream But I don't let it, let it get me down this fine old world, it keeps spinning around. I've been a puppet, a pauper, a pirate, a poet, a pawn and a king. I've been up and down and over and out. And I know one thing, each time I find myself flat on my face, I pick myself up and get Baby, but my heart just ain't gonna buy it. And if I didn't think it was worth one single try, I'd jump right on a big bird and then I'd fly. I've been a puppet, a pauper, a pirate, a poet, a pawn, and a king. I've been up and down and over and out, and I know. I'm gonna roll myself up in a big ball and die. My, 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 I got 
good news for you. The California Club at 1759 West Santa Barbara Avenue in Los Angeles presents the most gala New Year's weekend show ever. Starring the mighty Olympics, the incredible Incredibles, and Miss Dakota, the Sims twins. Dig the fabulous Joe Swift, whose great band has been the recording foundation for many Motown groups, perfecting that groovy Motown sound. Also, Bobby Lester and the Upsetters, four big nights, two shows nightly, tonight, Saturday, Sunday, and Monday. To tell it like it is and hear it and see it like it is, the gala New Year's weekend show of shows at the California Club, 1759 West Santa Barbara Avenue, Los Angeles. Call AX69873 for immediate reservation. <laughs> went out today, and so our studio door is open. I don't know what you're going to hear before the show's over. <laughs> hey there, Georgie girl, swinging down the street so fast. Hey For the Seekers, now the number 12 at a KFWB in the Jimmy O'Neill Show this afternoon. Georgie Girl sounds at 3.38 KFWB fun time and currently in Los Angeles, 61 degrees. Hey, I was just noticing it's really going to be windy tonight. Mostly clear, though. Sunny Saturday and Sunday with high clouds Sunday. And look uh, look at these winds. Strong, gusty north to northeast wind tonight through Saturday with local gales down the coastal canyons. Low temperature tonight, 44 degrees. A little warmer days. High Saturday, 72 degrees. Whatever you put in your shopping cart, you say. Be sure to shop the Thrifty Mart meat specials for your holiday entertaining. Big weekend sale on USDA choice steer beef. Chuck steak, 39 cents a pound. Seven bone roasts, 45 cents a pound. Round bone roast, 55 cents a pound. Choice lean beef and another money-saving meat special this weekend at Thrifty Mart. <laughs> I think this is BMR's theme song these days. <laughs> and I uh, know it's a former personal picture. It is the Buffalo Springfield singing for Something what it's worth. Happening here. What it is ain't exactly clear There's a man with a gun over there Telling me I got to beware I think it's time we stop 
children, what's that sound? Everybody look what's going down. There's battle lines being drawn. Nobody's right if everybody's wrong. Young people speak in their minds Are getting so much resistance From behind If I'm we stop Hey, what's that sound? Everybody look what's going down What a field day for the heat Thousand people in the street singing songs and they carry inside. Mostly say hooray for our side. It's time we stop. Hey, what's that sound? Everybody look what's going down. Social commentary there from the Buffalo Springfield entitled for what it's worth on the Jimmy O'Neill Show this afternoon at 342 and 61 degrees in Hollywood. KFWB, Channel 98. Please, I'm losing my mind. Help me now before it's too late. Try to bring me back. Everything's spinning. My eyes are tired. I'm losing my way. Where are you? Where am I? Everything's spinning. I must have some of you. I'm dizzy from wanting you. My eyes are getting tired. Help me now. Before it's too late.
Brown's children have a hit called Smashed, Blocked. And speaking of blocked, I'm sorry to inform you that uh, word fairly much applies to the San Bernardino Freeway eastbound between the interchange and the Long Beach Freeway. Actually, it's, it's not really blocked, but it's heavily congested to unusually heavy traffic. And the condition is expected to continue until approximately 6 p.m. <laughs> It's 3.45 at KFWB, and I want to tell you about a guy by the name of Keith. That's the only name he has, just Keith. No last name. He records for Mercury, and his latest record entitled 98.6 is the KFW Broadway Pick of the Week. So be sure to stop by your nearby Broadway store, visit their complete record department, and pick up a copy of this week's KFW Broadway selection, Keith on Mercury. The name of the song is 98.6. Here it comes right now. Slip it under your tongue and hope everything comes out normal. Six on KFWB, Jimmy O'Neill Show, 63 degrees in Hollywood and Diet Drink Right up. Cola. For that real old-time cola taste and no sugar at all, Diet Right Cola, America's number one low-calorie cola. Soon to become America's number one fast-rising group, in my opinion, the Buckingham sing a great song. That's the name of it. When your baby don't love you, kind of a drag. She's been untrue
is Beach Rogers, KFWB News. Britain calls for peace talks. That story in nine minutes. You're on the go with J.O. and the Jimmy O'Neill Show coming your way from America. Fastest rising radio station. KFWB, Channel 98. Where the action is. Where the action is. It's 351, 62 degrees in Hollywood. Get your color books out, gang. The two o'clock is here to color my world. I don't know, take a few weeks. Number 27 this way. You'll never see a dark cloud hanging round me. Now there is only blue sky to surround. degrees in Hollywood at exactly six minutes before the hour of four o'clock and time for KFWB News. Just six minutes from right now with Beach Rogers. Hey, I want to dedicate the next record to uh, a little buddy of mine I had the pleasure of meeting last night. I don't know if you heard me mention this a couple of weeks ago, but I was on uh, the dating game and uh, the girl picked me. So we went on a date last night. We went out to Melody Land to see the King family and uh, later went backstage to meet the uh, family. As many as we could. You know, there's about 50. I'm not going to get around to all of them. But I did meet one of the little King kitties. He's about five years old. And uh, her mommy introduced us, and she said, uh, these uh, people won us as a prize on the dating game, honey. And she said, oh, dear, do we have to go home with them tonight? The Eiffel Tower, Notre Dame, the Arc de Triomphe, burn them all, was the order that came shrieking over the phone. Is Paris burning? Now, while it is still a towering international bestseller, comes a motion picture to command the attention of the world. Is Paris burning? Special midnight performance of his Paris Burning tomorrow at the Warner Hollywood Theater. And here it is for my little King family, buddy. Herman and his Hermit sing it. East, west. East, west, over the ocean. Perpetual motion, traveling around. No rest, singing and playing. Night out and day in, doing the rounds. What a great life it must be. What a great life it must be. Sweat joints, everything classy, nothing that's passing. 
KFWB News is just three minutes away. Beach will be in to tell it like it is. And here to sing that song is Aaron Neville on the Jimmy O'Neill Show at 357, 61 degrees. If you want something to play with, go and find.